The talented team at the Brainerd Dispatch that produces this podcast would like to offer you a deal too good to pass up. Get three months of local news at BrainerdDispatch.com for just 99 cents a month. That's 99 cents for unlimited access. Subscribe now at BrainerdDispatch.com slash subscribe. Good morning, Brainerd Lakes area. It's Friday, February 23rd. I'm Dylan Howard with your Brainerd Dispatch Minute, the weekday podcast of the Brainerd Dispatch, named best daily newspaper in the state of Minnesota, catching you up on the news of the Brainerd Lakes area. Here are today's top local headlines. The Brainerd City Council decided not to issue a new automotive sales license to Tower Motors. Tower Motors license expired December 31, 2023, and the business, located at the 600 block of Washington Street, is no longer allowed to sell any automobiles without a secondhand automobile license. In a unanimous vote Tuesday, February 20th, the council cited repeated violations and late payments as the reason it would not be issuing a yearly secondhand automobile license to Tower Motors. Staff writer Tim Spire has more on this story in today's e-edition or at BrainerdDispatch.com. A number of residents voiced their concerns during a Tuesday, February 20th public hearing in front of the Cass County Board for the first reading of an ordinance regulating all-terrain vehicles on county highways and public right-of-ways. To read more, check out today's edition or find the story online. From former Dispatch publisher Terry McCullough's column, this was Brainerd, exploring the Dispatch archives. Here's today's tidbit of local history. Eighty years ago today, in 1944, the dispatch reported that Mr. and Mrs. D.C. Smith Brainerd received confirmation of their son William's capture by the Japanese through a telegram from Washington, D.C. A broadcast from a Philippine prison camp had been picked up earlier over shortwave in this country. He states his health is fine and that he is receiving Red Cross packages. For a daily dose of This Was Brainerd, visit BrainerdDispatch.com or find McCullough's column in the newspaper or e-edition. Now here's this weekend's Lakes Area Forecast, brought to you by Tanner Motors of Brainerd. Storm Tracker. Weather for the Brainerd area today, looking at some clouds to start off the day, but otherwise sunny skies, much colder though. Temperatures only in the mid-20s for the afternoon. We'll be looking at those clear skies continuing overnight tonight. And then for Saturday, the breeze picks up, but it's going to warm us up for the afternoon, getting back into the mid-40s. More 40s for Sunday, but still breezy. And we'll look at a very mild day on Monday. Temperatures getting back in the 50s. I'm Storm Tracker Meteorologist Robert Pointer. Thanks to Tanner Motors for their support. And thank you for listening to the Brainerd Dispatch Minute. For more news throughout the day and for information on becoming a subscriber, visit BrainerdDispatch.com. Have a great day, and we'll catch you on Monday.